Good afternoon, Lincoln Mitchell here. Um, disclaimer on the board, take your time, pause the video, read it. I would love to get a lot of output or replies on this video from the professional traders, people who actually really trade. Um, I got my wife right here with me. She's probably better than I am when it comes to trading. And let, let's get down to business here because I get a lot of requests on why I don't train and what should people focus on on the market and so forth and um so i got a i got a bar chart i'm about to pull up because a lot of people always ask me you know why do i use indicators do i do fundamentals do i do technical and so forth let's use this graph right here this is my perception or my concept of what i think the market is and the areas people should focus on the first area of course is other traders <laughs> don't put too much on other traders there's a 90-90 rule in this industry that says 90% of the traders will fail within 90 days. I mean, what, what do you think? I agree. You totally agree. News. Once again, I don't think you should focus on news as much, and I probably get a lot of grief why I gave news only 5%. The reason why I gave news 5%, the damn thing is so unpredictable. That's why. Most of all the traders I know that trade news... A lot of them lose. It's just too unpredictable for me. I mean, I mean, do you, do you agree? I mean, I don't know. I mean, that's my perception, you know, my, my concept of it. Indicators. I put indicators only 10%. The reason why I put indicators 10% is because, A, most of y'all don't know how to read them going into price action. Indicators are good, but indicators lag behind the next two upcoming categories. I mean... Your, your output on that? Between, yes. Okay. Go ahead. No, go ahead. Oh, I'll tell you. Candlesticks and patterns and formation. I gave that way more than I gave everything else. And the reason being because if you can see. A price? Nah. You can see the formation. You can see the formation. Oh, oh wait, okay. Action. I agree with you. You can see the price action better. You can see how the candlesticks are forming, where is the trends are going. You know, and the indicators just play into that. So to me, the, the, the candlesticks patterns of formation should be way more than, you know, I mean, am I correct? Mm -hmm. Okay. Price, 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 price. Price is king, people. Period. There's no, everything that you see before this feeds into price. Just like my wife said, on the candlesticks, you can see the price. Indicators represent price. News adjusts to the price. None of these around on this whole category or whatever you do, you will not get a round price. What do you think? I think price action is the key to trading, actually. And I, and I totally agree with that. I totally agree with that. Uh, you're not getting around price, people. If you're trading, you're taking any kind of thing, and people are really not showing you how to do price, action, and price, I'm sorry to tell you, you're not getting around it. I mean, I don't know what to tell you. You know, a lot of times when people ask me that, the first thing come out of my mouth is learn price, and they look at me crazy. They say, well, what kind of indicators you use? I don't use any. Not that I have anything against them. I don't use them. I use, they say, well, do you trade fundamentals? I don't trade fundamentals. To me, it's just too predictable. When I was trading, um, you know, stocks and options, you have something with a good, you know, quarterly report, and it is still drop. Yep. And then you have something with a bad quarter report, and the damn thing goes up. Correct. You know, so to me, it was just too unpredictable. The indicators I thought were okay, but indicators still lag behind price. An yeah. indicator is not going to tell you a big giant drop it'll tell you somewhere where you know where everybody kind of meet like the sma they can say okay this is where your average at but as far as when a market just drops down it doesn't show you that or predict that Correct. you know what i'm saying now but price even though a price might drop down to a certain level you can also see where that price action or the hysterical data will come into play am i let me correct me if i'm wrong right. you know and like i said i mean please don't take this offense to some of y'all. If you are not a real trader, don't comment on this video. Because sometimes I would get people come on my videos and they would comment. And I know they're not real traders by their comments. I know they're not. 
you know, and a real trader knows how to trade. That's why I said this is for a perfect. This is I'm not knocking some of y'all. So please don't jump on this at the bottom and pretend to make it seem like you know how to trade. Because trust me, you're going to make yourself sound stupid, you know, because we know how to trade. You know, we matter of fact, I don't know too many people who have done. We, we have traded a live trade with options live from begin from beginning to end. Not when it was in the profit. We have traded from you time you've seen us go into the trade, make a profit, and get out of that trade. We have done a binary the same way from beginning to end. Before we showed you trades before we went into them and came out of them. And we also did Forex. Now, I don't know anybody yet has done that. I mean, that's just me personally. I don't know, not one person has done that. And our next one is futures. I don't know one trader that has ever done that. Now I'm not trying to throw myself on a patty on a, on a, on a pedestal, but what I'm saying is, don't the novice traders don't step on here and make a comment. Trust me, we know what we're talking about. That's why we're making it for professional traders. Do you see what I'm saying? I'm not I'm not trying to dish you. I'm not trying to make you feel bad, and I'm not and I'm not going to stay on this too long, <laughs> you know. But the more to the story, I would love to hear the professional trader standpoint because to me, price is king. Please. Leave your comments at the big, at the bottom, and we can take it from there. Yummy, yeah, I you got anything? I kind of ran with it. No. Okay. All right. Lincoln Mitchell, see you.